is Chou Jie Zhao. You can call me Jimmy. And I'm 19 years old and I'm from Shanghai, China. Hi everyone, I'm Amber and my Chinese name is Shi Qi Fan. And I come from Nanjing, it's east part of China and I'm 18. Um, Nanjing is a very big city. It's almost the same weather like here, but it's like kind of uh, warmer in winter and cooler in summer. Next, I will go to introduce myself in Mandarin. 大家好,我叫赵秋杰,我来自上海,我今年十九岁了。I can introduce myself in Mandarin. 大家好,我叫石奇凡,我来自南京,很高兴认识你们。My father is now a manager of a, a closing company, and my mom now is a human resources at a company. Another big difference is the population, yeah. We have too many people there, so the government have to apply the one child policy. So, like the students, are like the my friends, which is my generation, they, they are the only child in the family. Well, I'm the only child uh, in my family, and I live with my parents, but we like live very close to my grandparents and my aunts. Yeah, we have like the very tight relationship between each other. Most of them are non-religious, like only a very few parts of them are religious. Yeah. The music, uh, most of my friends like American popular and American rocks and also British rocks. So like European American music are pretty popular in China. Hip hop and country music and many boys like rap. Government is different from here. It's a communist government, and it has a like a censorship, which is a uh, pretty harsh. I would like to say, but it's not so harsh compared to the old times. We don't have Facebook and Twitter in China. We can't log on to it, but we do have like the Chinese Facebook and Chinese Twitter. The rich people are very very rich, and the poor people are really poor. My friends, my families, and people I know is um, um, in the middle class. We have uh, the same um, classroom every day, and uh, different teachers come to my uh, like classroom for different courses. I live in my senior high school, like from Monday to Friday, and I go back home during weekends. I live in school since the second grade. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so like because my parents are pretty busy at that time, so they just sent me to school and I just live there from Monday to Friday and go back home during weekends. So it's, it's uh, convenient for them and also like it's built up the independence in yourself. We take Chinese, math, English, physics and chemistry like throughout the senior high school and we have music in sophomore year and art in uh, junior years. And we have history in sophomore years and geography. I would like you guys to know, like the normal Chinese food you have here is not authentic, especially the Jiangsu Sao chicken, the orange chicken, the Mongolian beef, and the fortune cookies. Those are the same invented by the American Chinese. So we don't have those things in China. So I was pretty surprised when I came here and I saw those things like, wow, those things, I've never seen them.